man, you can't believe what it was like for my first time. Like, I was crazy back then. Like, I was so ruthless and I was just so adventurous. Ugh. Just kidding. <laughs> hey guys, it's Jasmine and today I'm going to be doing my first time tag and this is basically a list of questions about things that I've done for the first time ever. So without further ado, let's jump into the questions. Question number one, first tweet. I had to go through my whole Twitter just to find my first tweet, but I don't think my laptop went all the way down because um, it just stop scrolling after a long while so I assumed that I should just stop there so my first tweet says I woke up late I don't expect anything more from me that's that's self-explanatory I always wake up late <laughs> first YouTube video actually my first YouTube video wasn't posted that long ago so if you still want to watch it you can go ahead and watch it I posted it like two months ago <laughs> it's the um easy prom makeup tutorial yeah first person you subscribe to on youtube so i really am leaning towards saying michelle fawn and i'm gonna go with my gut feeling and say that michelle fawn first facebook profile picture okay there it is i am um the one with i was gonna say with the glasses but I am that one right there. That's me. Do you still talk to your first love? No, I don't. Oh my gosh. What kind of question? Okay, so I did not go over um, all of these questions before uh, I started filming. So uh, some of these questions, you're going to get my first like actual like... <laughs> first response and um I do not talk to my first love no no <laughs> we don't associate we don't look at each other no 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 what was your first alcoholic drink I remember when I was little I thought wine was grape juice what was your first job working for grocery outlet what was your first car? Um, I don't have my driver's license, but catch me at your local amusement park. I'll be there driving the bumper cars, you know, that's my thing. Who was the first person you texted today? Today I texted my friend Gage. Hey, how are you? I know you're watching. What's good? How are you? Who was the first person you thought of this morning? Oh, so I had a dream of my ex, so when I woke up, I kind of thought of him, and I was like, Ooh. like, I was taken aback. Like, I woke up, and I was so confused. Like, <sighs> so confused. You know, I hate that. Like, I had a dream that he was, like, telling me that he was broke and he needed money, and I was like, yikes. Um, I can help you get a job, um, you know, I can help you apply, I don't know. <laughs> Who is your first grade teacher? My first grade teacher's name was Miss Spencer, and she was really cool, like, she had a lot of hope in me, and, um, I was the only person who knew how to spell Thanksgiving, and she was like, Jasmine, why don't you write Thanksgiving on the board so everyone can see, and I was like, me? Really? Where did you go on your first ride on an airplane? I went to Hawaii. Who was your first best friend and do you still talk? My first best friend, his name is Dominic, and yes, we do talk. Um, he's literally like my older brother. I couldn't ask for any other closer guy friend because, you know, he's he's been there for me ever since I came out the womb. So <laughs> we are literally like two peas in a pod. Is that right? Is that what it is? Two peas in a pod. Yeah, it is. It is. It is. Okay. Where was your first sleepover? My first sleepover was at my friend Victoria's house and that was in sixth grade. 
what was the first thing you did this morning? The first thing I did this morning was check if my phone was charged and to see if my laptop was dead. <laughs> What was the first concert you've ever went to? I went to a Britney Spears concert. I still love Britney Spears. Britney Spears is like my homegirl. She's like my spirit animal. I love her. I live for her. <laughs> first broken bone. I have actually never broken a bone. First piercing. Just my ears. That's the only piercing I have. First foreign country you've been to. I went to Cambodia um, this past winter break and that was so fun we went for three weeks and it was so eventful so hot even in winter and yeah it was so much fun and i know that my cousins are watching this video from over there so hi how are you i miss you first movie you ever remember seeing Ugh. I just remember watching a lot of shows, but I mean, if I had to choose a movie, I would probably say Bring It On. When was your first detention? Oh my god, this is so funny. Okay, so in fourth grade, I moved from Martinez to Fairfield, and you know how it is being the new kid and you just not wanting a, to associate with anybody and you're just lost about the location and you're just so confused because I don't know about you, but whenever I'm in a new place, I am just so confused. I, I get so lost and my face is literally like, everywhere I, I don't know and um basically this story so one day I get called to the principal's office and I didn't know where it was I was so confused I, I had to ask the yard dude I'm like I got called to the principal's office I don't know where it is I'm so confused and um you know I'm I used to be super super shy and I didn't really want to um be adventurous and make new friends right away you know I was kind of just like I want them to come to me like talking to me so basically I go into the office and the principal is saying to me how um I was making fun of this girl and I was like I know she was in like I know her name because she's the only one with that name in my grade and so I was like Oh, like I know her because she's in my class, but I've never associated with her. I've never talked to her. And she was saying how I called her names and all that stuff. And I was like, but I didn't. And I guess the principal didn't believe me because you know how kids are. Like some kids are just like, oh, no, I didn't do it. But actually, like they did. But I don't know if she knew that I was the new kid. And I was just, I don't know. I was like, a crybaby back then and I was just so sad and I was like I don't know what I did wrong like I'm the new kid I honestly felt so attacked and you know no one was there to save me and um, I got detention for a week and um, I tried telling the principal that I didn't do it. I tried telling the teacher that I didn't do it and they're just like well you need to have like evidence and I was like what like I don't even talk to her like isn't that enough evidence because they took me out of recess and they took me out of lunch and they took me like in the morning if I got there early so basically I never got to talk to her and it was so irritating because I was trying to find the reason why I got detention and it was just so irritating okay and um finally I catch her walking to class and I'm like hey hey and so like I grab her and I'm like listen and I explained to her the whole situation and she was like, oh, I didn't say Jasmine, I said Jessie. Jessie does not sound like Jasmine. <sighs> ah, so rude. And so finally I told my teacher and my teacher was like, you know, I'm gonna go tell the principal. And then the principal, I guess like she just, she just never liked me ever since then. No, I'm like, why? Like you didn't do it. You know, I'm just here to have a good time, but all these teachers and the administration is just making me feel really attacked and... Who was your first roommate? My sister, because we shared a room. <laughs> yeah, I'm still in high school. Um, I don't dorm, so I don't really have a roommate, but that's the best answer I can provide. If you had one wish, what would it be? 
I wish for people to have consideration about other people's feelings. What was the first sport you were involved in? The first sport I was ever involved in was swimming. What is the first thing you do when you get home? I wash my hands. I think that's weird for some people, but you know, you're outside, you're touching things and it's like, I don't know, I don't feel safe around touching other things and then just like not washing my hands. I don't know, I feel like my house is really clean. So when I wash my hands in a clean area, I feel extra clean. So I don't know, like even though like I wash my hands in like bathrooms and like carry on hand sanitizer, still freaks me out a little bit. Um, so I just feel really clean at home. When was your first kiss? That's funny because my first kiss was actually from Dominic when I was three. And our parents like photographed it. So embarrassing. So embarrassing. I'm pretty sure he has a picture still, so. Uh, yikes. All right, you guys, that wraps up this first time tag and yeah, I hope you guys liked it. Hope you found it kind of hilarious because I was so crazy. Can't even believe it. And if you want to see more videos like this, feel free to leave it down in the comment section. Thumbs up this video if you enjoyed it. And subscribe if you haven't. Until then, I love you and peace out, Girl Scouts.